my son, uh, which looks like a uh, Gosan clone, has arrived today from China. Let's see if we can unpack this. That's the cooker. Goes inside the tube. What do we got here? Instruction manual in Chinese. Okay. That is very useful. Uh, not. Opening it up. Uh, looks like it's got plastic film over the um, metal reflector. Is it bent? I wonder if it's supposed to be bent like that. Probably not. Okay, we'll see if I can get this cooking. This hook here is supposed to latch onto the other side to stop it swinging up um, to opening up, fanning out, um, and it doesn't seem to be long enough. This is the cooking tube. The handle is screwed inside, let's undo that. These edges are a little bit sharp. I guess these are um, spears. And looks like there's a, a vent for excess heat to get out through this plastic rubber seal. And uh, there's a screw here that tightens the uh, inch, I think. Okay chicken in, uh, so we shouldn't have problems with thermal shock because I've only just put it outside. But unfortunately, today is a very cloudy day and it may not cook at all. No. I've removed the green scrubbing brushes or pads, put the chicken in and we'll leave it for a couple of days or an hours rather, but as you can see it's a pretty cloudy day. Three quarters of an hour and the ambient temperature according to the weather is 16 degrees. Oh, okay. Steaming. You can see the steam coming off. Wow, really hot. Okay. Then put that back in and grab one to try it out. Perfectly cooked. Three quarters of an hour, 16 degrees ambient temperature, partially cloudy day in Wellington.